Hello friends, hope you are doing well. Today's video topic is if your USB pen drive or your USB is not recognized or not detecting in your system. In this video, we are going to fix this issue. So as you can see, I already connected my USB pen drive, but it is not showing here. So the first step you can try is right click on your windows icon. Then click on this option disk management. You will see this window disk management. So as you can see, this is my disk zero. This is my internal hard drive of 240 GB and disk one is my USB pen drive of 8 GB. So my pen drive is showing in disk management, but it, it is not showing here. So to fix this issue, what I have to do is I have to simply assign a drive letter to my pen drive. So right click on your pen drive, then click on this option, change drive letter and path. Now assign a drive letter. So click on add and now you can assign any drive letter. So I will go for let's suppose J then click on OK. So the drive letter has been assigned. Now cut this window drive letter has been assigned as you can see now cut this window as you can see now my pen drive is showing and all the data is remain safe so there is no data loss at all so this is your first step you can try to fix this issue now move on to a next step if your pen drive or your usb is not showing in disk management so the next step you can try is click on your windows icon now type windows PowerShell you will see this option here Windows PowerShell so right click on it then click on run as administrator now you have to type a command to run the troubleshooter so the command will be so this is the command type this command carefully then press enter and you will see this window hardware and devices click on this advanced option and make sure tick this option apply repair automatically tick this option then click on next so this will diagnose your pc and this will fix your issue as well so you have to wait for a few minutes now after that click on this option apply this fix and after that restart your system and it will fix your issue now move on to a next step if you are still getting the same issue right click on your windows icon then click on device manager now here you will see this option universal serial bus controller expand this option now you have to update all the usb drivers one by one so uh, simply right click on the first one then click on update driver then click on browse my computer then click on let me pick from now select the driver then click on next so this will update your USB driver. Click on close. Now it will ask for restart. Click on no. So I will restart my system manually after updating all the drivers. So now click on the second one. Then click on update driver. Browse my computer. Let me pick from select the driver. Click on next. Do the same thing and update all the USB drivers one by one and after that restart your system and this will fix your issue. Now move on to our final step. Click on your windows icon then click on this option settings. In this find box type power and sleep. You will see this option power and sleep settings. Click on it. Now on the right side click on this option additional power settings. Now on the left side, click on this option, change when the computer sleeps. Then click on this option, change advanced power settings. You will see this window, scroll down, click on this option, USB settings, expand this option. Then expand this option as well, USB selective suspend settings. And now you have to disable both the options one by one. Disable both the options, select disable. Then click on apply, then click on OK, cut this window and restart your system and this will fix your issue as well. So these are the steps you can try. This is all for the video. Thank you.